This is NoonStatement.tv. Assalamu alaikum and welcome to Noon Statement uh, TV. In this video, I will deliver to you, inshallah, amazing scientific facts from the statement of uh, the Holy Quran. We will know scientific details about the creation of uh, this great universe and clear proofs about the planet X, uh, the torment uh, planet uh, existence. And through this knowledge, we came known uh, to the cosmology scientists only after the scientific uh, revolution in the last uh, 70 years. But you will know it has been already written in the same book since more than 1,400 years, and this is really amazing. Let's start with the creation of uh, the universe, how it was before it uh, became into being, and how it will end. In fact, the whole universe is expanding in all directions, getting bigger and bigger like a balloon inflating. I admit this sounds strange, but to cosmologists, it's like winning the lottery. Because to work out where the universe came from, all we need to do is to stop time and make it run in reverse. Rewind far enough, and everything gets closer together. A lot closer together. All the galaxies, in fact, every single thing, converges to a single point. The start of everything, 13.7 billion years ago. So it's quite simple, really. Follow the clues, and we can deduce that a very long time ago, the universe simply burst into existence. An event called the Big Bang. As we know, the cosmology scientists have discovered that the universe was compressed into one great mass. Then it exploded uh, with the great heat in all uh, directions. They said that the universe uh, has an estimated age of 13.799 plus or minus 1.021 billion years. This means the error range is uh, about 20 million years. They still don't know where was uh, the center point of uh, the explosion and they think that the universe is still expanding. Now let's see the fact of uh, the Big Bang uh, from the statement and uh, the video. From Surah Al-Anbiya, verse number 30, Allah Ta'ala said, Do not those who disbelieve uh, see that the skies and the earth were one mass. So we turn and split them, and we made uh, from water everything uh, living. Will they not uh, then believe truth from Allah the Great? We need to know that uh, this great uh, verse was not uh, for the disbelievers in the age of the Prophet Muhammad, praise be upon him, as uh, they didn't know that the universe was uh, one man's at that uh, time. But this verse is uh, for our age, for the people who have the scientific vision in the age of uh, the awaited Mahdi, Imam Nasir Muhammad. As uh, the awaited Mahdi will prove uh, to you the scientific facts of the Holy Quran and will prove the center point of uh, the Big Bang. Same, he will prove the fact of the uh, planet X, the planet of uh, torment existence before it uh, arrived. 
so you may believe before the sun will rise from the west on the land to the right. From the statement we knew that the center point for the Big Bang was the mother planet which turned from it the seven skies, seven earthly planets and all the stars. It's uh, the planet in which Allah Ta'ala made the secret of life and the secret of life is uh, water and no life uh, without water. From Surah Hud verse number 7 Allah Ta'ala said and his uh, throne of power was in water. Truthful Allah agreed. As if uh, the water is found then rain, trees and the human life are uh, found. Therefore, the planet which its uh, symbol is the water in the Grand Quran is uh, this planet where we are uh, living, the Earth. It was uh, the center point for the Big Bang and it's the center point for the universe. Allah Ta'ala said, Allah is who created seven skies and the Earth alike. The command uh, descends among them that you may know that Allah is born of power over all things and that Allah surrounds all things in His knowledge. Truthful Allah is This uh, verse is clear and evident that earth is uh, located uh, between the seven skies and to lower of it uh, the seven earthly planets. We will know next that the lowest uh, planet is uh, the planet of Thorn, planet X. In truth, this verse is uh, a miracle for the elder prophet that he was truly receiving the Quran from a wise, all knowing creator. The command descends among them, and the command is uh, the grand Quran being uh, sent uh, down to the prophet Muhammad, praise be upon him. And he was in the center of uh, the center. As uh, Earth is uh, the center of uh, the universe, the center point is uh, the Kaaba, in Allah, the great uh, house. And all planets and stars float around in the circle, from the right uh, to the left, around it, glorifying uh, the wise uh, creator, the uh, glory to him. The seven earthly planets are existing after this earth on which we live uh, to the lowest space starting uh, from Mars and the lowest is planet G, the torment planet. It is what you named it uh, planet Nibir or uh, the tenth planet uh, planet X. And through the torment planet is uh, the hell itself and you have to know that uh, Prophet Muhammad, praise be upon him, had uh, warned uh, the disbelievers before more than 1,400 years that if they continued uh, the disbelief in the Quran, Allah's message to all people that surely Allah Ta'ala will sin against the disbelievers a painful torment from it. The time of uh, the torment as it's written in the book is in the age of the awaited night, our age now. And in the statement you can find all the details about this planet structure and its orbit uh, duration. The coming pass of uh, the planet of torment is not the end of life and it is not uh, the hour, the judgment uh, day, but it is one of the major signs of uh, the hour. Then life uh, will continue until the end, that's uh, the hour. And when the end uh, will come, the universe will return back to the beginning. I mean, uh, the skies, stars and planets will collapse back into the mother earth. 
I advise you to read the statements of the awaited man, Imam Nasir Muhammad Rahman, and ask Allah Ta'ala to show you the truth, so you be from the winners, uh, believers, and peace be with God.